But I notice you like wife, wife. I love wife. You like wife, wife. Wife, wife? I like wife as well, but I often say, this is my life partner. We no, got no, no, married no. 11, 11, 11. I'll come right out and say, oh, did you meet my wife? I want you to meet my wife. That's the first, I want to introduce you to my wife. Hi, Gail Marquis, campus of Queens College, and I'm being inducted into the inaugural class, the first class of the Queens College Athletic Hall of Fame. In the middle of going to college, I went there to play basketball, and I was lucky enough to play for our U.S. Olympic team. It was the first time they ever had women's basketball at the games. I also came home with a silver medal, which I did not plan. I grew up in Queens, St. Alban, Queens, New York. There were five of us growing up, and I was a middle child. I always like to say confused. We were five in the family, as I told you, I had two older brothers. I was born in Harlem, so I'm a, I'm a native Harlem person. I like to tell everybody that I was born, bred, toasted, buttered, jelly, jammed, and honeyed in Harlem. I was a model, and I modeled from 15 until I was about 26. I was a fashion commentator for Ebony Magazine, a fashion editor for Vogue Magazine. And now I live on 55th Street, just off Fifth Avenue, and Donald Trump moved in my neighborhood. I work out of my home suite office. It's my small business called The Ground Crew, and we do fashion shows, fashion shoots, and fashion videos. And I've been in business for 35 years, dressing those models and getting them out there, ready to rock and roll down that runway. I was a pro ball player in America, in the south of France, later on commentating also for the WNBA. Then I decided let me go to Wall Street because it was very competitive. Between Merrill Lynch, J.P. Morgan Chase, personal banker, decided I liked it, this is where I'm gonna stay. We keep two residences between New York and New Jersey, so it's nice to have two places to go. And I love coming here. When I get here, I'm a whole nother person. We met officially on February 7th, 1999. We didn't start dating. Our first date was May 1st, 1999. Oh, I'm foremost in her mind. I'm first. She says, I'm first. Can you imagine? Well, aren't I first in your mind? Yes. We got married after 12 years. 12 and a time, half years. When the time came Because November's 11, May is 5, 7 years, 12 and a half years. The day was perfect. When you finally got out of the car and you came across Central Park West, <gasps> oh, my God, she's so gorgeous in that yellow jacket. Thank oh, my you. God, you look I fabulous. I a here to cover my neck. We had a good time. You had this beautiful scarf. I remember the scarf. Mm -hmm. I just said foulard. That's right. Okay. That's French for Ooh, scarf. Oh, I know. Yellow and I know. French for scarf. We have come together here in this holy place to witness and bless the joining of Audrey and Gail. May you know for each other that you are an awesome surprise in the world. <laughs> Getting to be an old, boring couple already. No, we're not boring, Gail. That's the one thing we are not. What does our life look like for the next 20 years? Well, I'm going to work with the ground crew as long as I can work. I want to paint, and we're going to travel. Beyond that, we're going to look for good health. We yeah, we want to be continue together. with our good health. We help each other. We boost each other. You know, it's leaning on each other. We're committed wife and wife. We're committed life partners. We're committed to each other. Right? You said it. I can't say it any better okay, than that. Good.